Over the last few years, AI systems have become astonishingly good at turning text prompts into videos. At the core of how these models operate is a deep connection to physics. This generation of image and video models works using a process known as diffusion, which is remarkably equivalent to the Brownian motion we see as particles diffuse, but with time run backwards and in high dimensional space. This video of an astronaut was generated by an open source model called WAN 2.1. If we dig into our WAN model's source code, we'll find that the video generation process begins with this call, creating a video where the pixel intensity values are chosen randomly. Here's what it looks like. From here, this pure noise video is passed into a transformer. This is the same type of AI model used by large language models like ChatGPT. But instead of outputting text, this transformer outputs another video that now looks like this. Still mostly noise, but with some hints of structure. This new video is added to our pure noise video and then passed back into the model again, producing a third video that looks like this. This process is repeated again and again. Here's what the video looks like after five iterations, 10, 20, 30, 40, and finally 50. Step by step, our transformer shapes pure noise into incredibly realistic video.